Autumn Johnson for NCAA Digital, and in this segment, Stanford's head coach Tara Vanderbeer is going to create her dream player. Here's how it works. I gave Coach Vanderbeer 10 categories, and she only gets to pick one player in her 35 seasons at Stanford to build her ultimate Cardinal dream player. Uh, the quarterback, I'd go with Sonia Henning. Uh, she was the a person that really ran our offense really well. Um, just, you know, really intelligent player, someone that um, was a two-way player, worked hard at both ends of the court, and uh, very unselfish player. Kay Starver just loved to score. Uh, she, well, she had some great moves going to the basket. Uh, she really never met a shot she didn't like. Uh, she knocked down threes. She might, uh, I mean, she just was a, a natural scorer. Um, you know, she, when she came into Stanford, she, the first thing she said to me is, are you going to change my shot? And I said, not if it goes in. And I never had to change her shot. Uh, NECA is just a, just an outstanding person, someone that cared a lot about her teammates. She was a great leader and, uh, someone that, uh, you know, our, our team loved um, playing with a um, very unselfish player, someone that always cared about everyone all the time. Oh, I got to go with her sister, Chanae. Uh, Chanae Ogumake would get it done. You know, if there was a play that needed to be made, whether it, what, if it was rebounding, defense, Chanae, she was someone always uh, kind of on the front lines, a battler. She was a warrior. Uh, I'd have to go with uh, Kristen Folkel. Kristen uh, could come in. Uh, she played volleyball and basketball. She was an All-American in both basketball and volleyball. Uh, came in, you know, first day could dunk. I mean, she just really is really, really talented. The clutch gene. Uh, Candace Wiggins. If you needed a basket, if you needed a play made, she would make it. Um, Candace was a four-time All-American, a two-way player, just tremendous uh, competitor. So she always found a way for our team to win. She got big time steals, um, you know, just uh, scored. It just There's so many games that she was our clutch player. Roz would constantly look at the score to see what her, how many points her player had gotten. She had a forearm on people. She was a kind of a heavy defender, um, very aggressive, uh, strong players, loved to play defense and uh, loved, loved the uh, idea of shutting people down. Jennifer AZ uh, was someone that uh, really came in, she started as a driver, but she worked on her three-point shot and the three-point line came in and uh, she could really knock down shots and she practiced a lot. She was always in the gym. She always wanted me to rebound for her and she really improved a lot, but someone that was very dedicated. Uh, Jane Appel is the heart. Uh, Jane Appel loved playing at Stanford. Um, she really was a, a great uh, center for us, um, had great hands, could score left, right, um, just a, a great teammate and someone that uh, everyone depended on. Carly Samuelson. Uh, Carly Samuelson, a really, really smart player. Uh, someone that, uh, you know, if we forgot, if the coaches forgot a drill, she would remember it. Um, a really, really intelligent player and a great player to coach. And she will be a coach someday. From the same spot. You cannot lose Carly Samuelson.